Assalamualaikum dan salam sejahtera kepada para penonton Bersama saya MC Akilah Dan saya MC Aisyah okay. Bersama kami Visual Talk Show by Worker dan Bad Okay Anisha, okay, sebenarnya motif kita pada hari ni apa sebenarnya? Anisha um, pun tak sure tapi yang saya tahu kita akan interview um, people that sing, entertain others, jadi post ke, apa yang berlakon ke So sebenarnya apa yang kita buat sebenarnya hari ni kira? Okay, untuk pengatuan Anisha, sebenarnya kita punya visual talk show ni adalah under a heart of the arts Anisha tahu tak heart of the arts apa? Heart of the arts? Tak pernah dengar apa? Apa tu? Okay, Heart of the Arts ini merupakan satu event yang dianjurkan oleh Astana Unitel ya? uh, Dan ia melibatkan semua anak-anak seni akan membuat persembahan Dan anda sebagai penonton membuat sumbangan di bulan Ramadan Dan sumbangan itu akan diberikan kepada rumah anak yatim iaitu rumah anak yatim Al-Kawsar di Bali Oh maksudnya sambil kita dengar lagu, kita tengok orang berlakon, orang entertain kita sambil itu kita menyumbang Oh bagus lah Ya yeah, betul Nisha. So kepada sesiapa penonton yang ingin menyumbang kepada rumah-rumah anak yatim yang kita orang senaraikan So anda boleh buka description dekat situ akan tertera pembuat akaun untuk anda memberi sumbangan lah Okay tanpa kita mengubah mangsa lah Nisha. Nisha tahu tak kita nak interview siapa ni sebenarnya? Hmm, yang Nisha tahu uh, orang-orang yang kita interview ni dia orang famous tau dekat UD10 Uh, ada yang famous hosting lah, kerja di samping doa Ada yang famous TikTok Ada yang nyanyi, siap buat lagu, kompos lagu sendiri Siapa dia orang ni kira? Oh dia orang ni dah syar-syar orang dia So kita jangan membuang masa lah Nisha Mesti penonton semua tak sabar nak tengok siapa sebenarnya kita punya tetamu ni So apa lagi? Mari kita jemput Dizzy, Adam dan Fami Assalamualaikum semua Hello Selamat Ramadan semua Hello Hello Haji memang Hello. cerita Wah ceria semua Di bulan Ramadan ni Sahur yeah. apa? Sahur yang elok-elok Sahur kurma sahaja Alhamdulillah Alhamdulillah Boleh lah Okay jadi kami sebagai host ni Kami dah kenal anda bertiga Sebab kita semua kawan Tapi orang yang tak kenal tu Mungkin orang tak cinta, tak kenal kan? Makin tak cinta Apa kata korang? Perkenalkan diri korang Background korang, apa yang korang buat? Kita... Lepas apa lagi dah cinta tadi ya? Oh. Ya betul, betul Kita mulakan dengan Cuba perkenalkan diri anda Hai, Assalamualaikum semua um, First of all, uh, salam Ramadan semua uh, Selamat berpuasa um, Okay, uh, saya Nama yang diberi Muhammad Daniel sebenarnya uh, Tapi most people dekat Unitel and I memang suka sebuah di sini uh, I'm known by DZ lah uh, so saya uh, third year second sem student uh, saya mm-hmm. berget aktif dalam theater uh, that's theater is my passion lah uh, and the other passion yang I suka is hosting juga lah I'm also one of the uh, MC in MC Benji's Unitel um, and currently I'm also the live streamer for Lazada Wow, so, <laughs> wow. Uh, Basically, I love to talk lah. uh, I love to talk <laughs> untuk dapat job talk juga Betul, uh, nampak tu dia suka bercakap Tak apa, nampak nampak tu. dia suka tamu hmm. macam ni hmm, Dasha uh, ni, nanti kita confuse Siapa MC ni ni Syah, bahaya ni Betul, ni. tak apa, <laughs> dia, dia, dia ambil job kita ni Ah uh, tu bahaya tu <laughs> Tapi nanti payment kena pass kat aku lah oh, Baiklah, baiklah Kita ni macam sekejap lagi Belakang, belakang, okay. belakang, belakang. Okay, Itu itu saja daripada saya, terima kasih Tetamu okay, saya kita, kita biarkan Adam perkenalkan diri Ya, yeah, woo Okay, Assalamualaikum semua dan Salam Ramadan uh, Nama dia beri Wan Adam Fikri Dia orang Farid People call me Adam And with my internet name I usually go by Debbie wow. uh, As in D-A-B-I I don't know, it's like <laughs> internet Ini persona aku macam tu So uh, I'm taking mechanical engineering course in Unit 10 And I used to be in SMU As an ambassador And also <coughs> I did uh, Singing performance in Asena And for the time being Masa-masa kosong ni buat tiktok lah Buat tiktok <laughs> uh, nice. Buat content sikit Entertain people sikit Macam so, tu lah 
Uh, so that's all for me. Oh, nak tanya sikit ada-ada maksud tersirat ke Debbie tu? Hmm, betul? Oh. Tak tahu juga, tak tahu juga tu. Macam I macam I wonder, kita rasa semua wonder. Mana datang Debbie? Betul lah, mana ada wonder tu? Internet Debbie. Hmm. Okay, okay. Cerita macam ni. It's like 2-3 years ago kot, masa mula nak berjinak-jinak dengan internet And then uh, I wanted to find a nickname macam tu So macam biasa lah, orang ni ni kan orang macam Shampoo, minat dia orang ke, kucing ke apa kan So uh, Debbie ni, Debbie tu is actually my nickname masa MSM dulu Ah, uh, uh, yeah, sebab Dad lah uh, Awe Kelate, kalau Awe Kelate Oh, oh my god ah. Kalau dia ikhlas dia, Adam panggil ada. Mm. Ah, so wow. siapa dia dah kalau kan tu dia. Pasu B tu is, is an anime character from my favorite show. Ah. So gabung dua tu jadi Debbie. Ini betul lah melekat sampai sekarang. Wah. Wow. So wow. tu lah cerita dia. Palu ada. It's a it's a pretty good name lah surprisingly. So yeah. Wow, sangat melekat eh dengan Adam. Saya faham maksud ni. Selama ni wonder kenapa Debbie Betul, bukan Nisha seorang je. Kila pun sama. Hmm, Kila pun wonder. Apa dia <coughs> sebenarnya? Hmm. Okay, terima kasih Adam. Kita ke tetamu seterusnya. Fahmi, sila perkenalkan diri anda. Hmm. Haji Memashte, Salam Ramadan. Oh. Nama saya <laughs> Muhammad Ali Fahmi. Boleh panggil Fahmi. And my stage name is Awan Hitam. I am a music producer yeah. and a singer songwriter. So previously uh, saya study dekat Unit 10 ambil foundation in IT and now I'm uh, pursuing my study in software engineering at UniKL. So um, so far uh, I produce uh, around 6 or 7 songs and I'm joining a band named Sunday and I am a drummer for the band. Yeah, wow. that's me. Dia bukan takkan buat lagu je tau. Dia bukan buat lagu je tau, dia drama juga okay. Jangan main-main. Singa, songwriter, drama. Ini betul-betul an entertainer ni korang semua ni. Ya, yeah, betul. Tema korang kita ni journey of entertainer. Yes, korang, korang model sini. Korang lagi hosting, berlakon, menyanyi, semua boleh buat. Baik bagus lah semua. Okay, dapat kita terputus hubungan eh. Terputus. Akhirnya terputus. <laughs> saya terputus. Maafkan saya. <laughs> Maafkan saya. Saya terputus. Ya, Seperti talian. Uh, bersama saya. Saya tak kena lagi. Dah terputus. Dah terputus. Duduk sini. Okay. Uh, kalau macam tu Nisha lah. Nisha. Boleh saya bahasakan dia saya Nisha eh. Sebab dah biasa Okay, Nisha nak tanya lah uh, Dizzy, Adam dengan Fahmi uh, Korang buat uh, Those things yang as an entertainer ni Sebab memang for fun ke Ataupun memang minat, fully minat Nak nak uh, macam memang nak invest masa In that path uh, We start with Dizzy Okay, uh, jadi um, About my journey as suppose Korang dengar eh Boleh, boleh, boleh Boleh, boleh, boleh Sebenarnya Uh, let's talk about Lazada dulu kan Cerita dia Initially tu buat senang-senang je uh, Dia macam sebab hmm. member Ada jual cookies, ada jual barang Macam why not just review lah kan Review, tutup um, Masuk competition Lepas tu menang Dah menang, lepas tu now I'm signed to Lazada So Basically everything that I want Is all about passion lah Passion sebenarnya uh, What I pursue is in passion cuma Kadang-kadang, rezeki tu not not just one passion lah. Uh, macam, I minat berlakon, uh, I minat MC, I minat hosting, I minat uh, perform semua tu. Uh, but then, Alhamdulillah, rezeki I uh, lebih kepada uh, a host and a review lah. So, that's, that's where I am right now. I'm still learning. I'm still a beginner je. Uh, but, yeah, the bottom line is definitely passion first lah. I never thought of like, um, whether orang suka ke tak For me personally, I macam nak tak korang lah I enjoy what I do Dia macam, if you enjoy, um, you're welcome If you don't enjoy pun, uh, thank you for watching lah Yes, <laughs> of <tu>. course <laughs> uh, uh, I think, yeah Kita so can move on to uh, satu lepas ni uh, so uh, nak, nak, nak dengar juga, dia orang punya macam mana So, it, was, it started uh. with just 
for fun. Lepas itu terus jadi a full carrier. Mm. Well, not a full carrier. Yes. But yeah, uh, you are sign. Dasyat eh. Dia is lazy. Dia basically, dia dia macam ni lah. Macam this one word lah, I always pegang. If you do something that you love, uh, you never have to work any apa tu, any of the day for the rest of your life. Mm. So, I am really grateful lah and sangat bersyukur. Alhamdulillah. Dapat uh, <laughs> part time work. <laughs> A part time work uh, yang I am passionate and I memang love. Betul. Lagi pada kita, apa yang kita minat, kita jadikan benda tu reality. Betul. Betul. Benda tu actually, yes. Rezeki tu, kalau Betul. you do what you love, insya Allah rezeki datang. Ah, do what you love first. <laughs> Betul, that's correct. Money. Yes. <laughs> Not money first. Do what you love first. Now, yeah. I want to hear okay. from Aida. Betul. Ah. Jangan terkejut. <laughs> yeah, ni orang-orang hebat ni. <laughs> Sekejap. Uh, ulang balik soalan tu. Do you, uh, uh, those things yang menyanyi, modeling and also being an uh, an entertainer dekat uh, any platform yang ada Is it because hmm. macam of masuk saja-saja je ataupun memang minat like Oh, I want to do this, which is or not? Hmm. Okay, um, actually memang daripada awal lagi it's actually minat sebenarnya And not just for fun uh, for me, I found myself as a character kan I like to express or create something and then express myself Memang uh, from modeling and TikTok and singing It's all about expressing my passion what? towards art lah macam tu And uh, yes and Kalau boleh lah one day I want to make that passion of mine tu Macam uh, easy lah as a side income ke Kalau boleh, wow. ambil income tu tak apa Jadi full time <laughs> InsyaAllah <laughs> boleh, amin, amin uh, yes. So, uh, part of the things that I do ni memang betul-betul um, my fu- Fully my passion lah to do something about it And um, actually pave my a career ke out of it Macam tu uh. And, uh, and sebenarnya kalau buat benda macam Orang yang macam orang tanya soalan kan Ni side income ke for fun ke apa Kita macam tak payah Tak payah malu pun sebenarnya Kalau benda tu macam hmm, Betul betul macam betul Macam ada orang tak suka ke apa betul. kan Haa ada orang tak suka ke macam In our society kadang-kadang the things hmm. that we do Art ni macam trivial tau Haa padahal it's actually quite important lah To yeah. have a little bit betul, of Betul kind betul betul Lagi-lagi kita yang ambil course yes. yang so quite berat juga tak kisah engineering or CSIT we need to have uh, color hmm. main dengan numbers je hmm. yes true <laughs> uh, coming from our group pun kita semua engineering kan betul, so betul, yeah betul, betul. we should be betul? actually macam diving into arts juga lah true bagus eh it was a good one betul oh. like to come to think of it we are well everyone in here we are we are taking a course that is that are relating to numbers so macam why not we just Betul, 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 Nampaknya macam lost connection Okay Okay Hello um, Boleh dengar tak? Boleh dengar? Okay dah Okay, okay. okay. sekarang okay dah Okay <laughs> Okay Dengar ke soalan tadi? Uh, nak nak saya ulang soalan tadi ke? Dah okay Oh, <laughs> still lagi Okay tak? Oh, dah okey ke? Dia pun seorang pemuzik. Boleh? Apa-apa pun boleh. Betul. Auto-tune eh? Oh, macam tu eh? Tak sangka. Dia cakap pun nak pakai auto-tune. Betul tu. Tak pakai auto-tune. Tak pakai. Tak pakai. Tak pakai. Okay, dah okey aku. Dah okey. Okay. Alright. Okay, Fahmi. Saya nak tahu lah. Macam masuk bidang muzik ni Awal-awal tu dulu dia macam memang Alam saiz-saiz je Ataupun Memang Memang dah start minat So macam memang nak fokus kepada muzik Be honest Awal-awal tu dia macam just Do it for fun 
tak ada kira macam go tu apa pun dengan music just macam sebelum ni just macam cover lagu tu pakai uh, record pakai garage band semua and then from doubt macam macam ada satu benda lah saya fikir awal-awal nak buat music tu awal-awal nak cover tu nak cover lagu orang rasa macam nak buat rendition sendiri tau so instead of guna yang ada dekat youtube semua baik create sendiri so that I can make my own uh, rendition so I create something macam explore lah the garage band I started my music uh, my music production on garage band first and then mm-hmm. eh, dah discover garage band tu semua rasa macam Oh, shock juga eh kalau buat lagu pakai garage band ni macam It's like uh, Macam The sound of the garage band mm-hmm. Is equal to the market punya sound So, rasa macam Wow, this is something new and this is so interesting To make music with And then, buat dengan benda tu So Lepas buat Just for fun tu Rasa macam nak buat lagu sendiri And then, decide nak take it uh, to a professional level And then, I try uh, compose lagu, tulis lirik semua And then, I can sing as well So, why not buat nama sendiri And create my own music on my own so, buat, benda, buat semua benda on my own So, yeah, that's it Awal-awal tu, just macam Buat, just for fun And then Minat tu datang sendiri lepas semua benda yang kita tahu Macam semua knowledge pasal music semua Rasa macam push nak buat benda Something new uh, Step step up to the next level macam tu lah So that's it Wow A fact kan Nisha I I never can do music on guys But I'm macam tekan 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 Same jangan risau Jangan risau kita sama ni sama. Okay I'm not the only one Oh bukan bukan no no no, no. <laughs> Seronoknya pasal diorang ni Diorang start benda tu sebab diorang minat Diorang nak try something new And then Alhamdulillah benda tu adalah rezeki diorang Dan jalan tu terbuka untuk diorang So that's what make me feel like Wow, dahsyat lah diorang punya passion on that thing Yes And like to to just imagine daripada mana korang start And where you guys are now uh, It's so incredible korang macam Korang memang like benda tu Macam tak Macam mana nak cakap eh The journey dia macam step Macam relax je Tapi macam you guys just enjoy it Throughout Throughout yeah. yeah. Sampai yeah. sekarang yeah. Okay So uh, My uh, Okay Sekarang uh, My question is uh, Kalau Diberi peluang Untuk collaborate dengan Mana-mana artis ke Atau ke Pengacara Or any 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 person Yang famous In this Malaysia ke Tak kisah Malaysia ke Luar negara ke Tengoklah korang punya impian Korang nak collaborate dengan siapa? Uh, I, I ah, can, can, can start with Dizzy Okay, so, so <laughs> memang kita uh, yes, Dizzy but... dulu Patut ada uh, okay, Yes, yes yeah, <laughs> Ya betul <Okay. laughs> Ya yeah, betul Tak ada lagi cakap sangat Okay, uh, kalau one artist Sebenarnya For me personally Even if I can collaborate dengan you guys pun I would really really appreciate that way Because to be honest Um, everyone is unique, everyone is super fun, tak ada satu pun the same So, you guys are actually, I'm actually a fan of you guys juga So, just so you guys know lah uh, So, if you guys want to collaborate, let me know uh, but, but, if you guys still nak, nak, nama artis tu kan I would actually, um, a few that comes to my mind is uh, First of all, is Sean Steven, he is actually one of the Uh, MC yang I uh, work together dengan Lazada I tak pernah lagi buat live stream dengan dia So if Sean, if you're watching this I betul-betul want to have a live stream with you And the other artist yang I would also like to collaborate is uh, Zizan Razak lah Because <laughs> ramai orang tu cakap Ramai orang cakap ada Ira 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 Ada lah dia Ada Nama Sama Ada 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 He's also a rapper, so he's an actor, he's a host as well and Yeah, I think it will be so funny Because people cakap I look like Zizan And finally I can tell them I pernah collaborate dengan Zizan So uh, I think that that will be that will be so uh, cool I'm really looking forward for that lah A fair, so, a fair yes, Nisha nice. lah Nisha nak tahu Me as a, his friend Sendiri yang saya cakap Dude, you so much like Zizan Raza Zizan Raza is rapper <laughs> And then, he's hosting Semua memang sama 
So patut you should you should try. <laughs> Uh, but I think me and Zizan Probably pass on the level But tak pun amal you One fine day One fine day Confident kita kena ada Confident kita kena ada Okay Bagus Kalau tu kena tinggi Tak apa Tak apa tu Tak salah Okay How about Okay How about Adam Who do you want to Color frame with Okay Bagi saya lah uh, as, you, as you guys know, I'm also into like fashion stuff Kan, so uh, korang kena ke Ana Abu? Oh, yes. Pernah dengar I'm lah Pernah yeah. dengar uh, So Ana Abu ni is actually uh, Macam fashion designer, muka yeah. punya And actually she came from an engineering background juga So, uh, yeah, so her brand kan uh, Memang if you guys tengok dia punya brand, dia punya apa, apparel semua uh, It has a very unique, unique macam style to it But it's very close to home lah, faham? Dia macam, ah, dia macam tweet sikit kita punya traditional apa, baju kurung ke baju Melayu ke And I actually like that kind of stuff Macam we, we tweet, we tweet benda yang kita dah ada But we don't stray far from our origins lah, our roots uh, so to be able to macam model her brand ke ataupun ambassador ke to have a collab lah with Ana Abu and Co is actually a dream lah to me that would be dope man that would be dope yeah. that would be dope. Mm. Uh, I would uh, I would love to advocate our Malaysia punya macam heritage betul uh, kita punya baju uh, that's my number one collaboration lah for the time being and the next one since uh, I'm also into macam singing mm-hmm. cover, I would also love to collaborate with uh, one of our local punya record recording company juga tu. Macam contohnya um, this way up record. If you guys know, yeah, they they handle Ellipse and also Dunadi. Wow! Wow! Yeah! 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 If if I get the opportunity to macam work with your sound engineer couple, that will be also a great dream of mine. Mm-hmm. Yes, and also hopefully they can also realize my potential in somewhere that area of expertise. Mm-hmm. That is interesting to know. Well, <laughs> let's hope and pray for the best that you will uh, become, uh, I mean, collaborate with anyone. Mm. Um, Such a good dream. I mean, <laughs> all right, last one for me. Who do you want to collaborate with? If you give it a chance. So, <coughs> kalau as in macam songwriting ataupun share stage yang sama untuk perform, as in collaboration punya uh, style, uh, rasa macam sebenarnya ramai tau nak collab. Mm-hmm. Tapi yang paling paling nak collab dengan Mafiz lah kot. Mafiz is a local indie band. Uh, mm-hmm. So, Rasa macam fun oh, nak you. buat fun nak buat music dengan dia orang since saya punya uh, penulisan lirik dengan coding semua semua uh, selalu cakap uh, we have that uh, same kind of soul in uh, songwriting and the melodies and the uh, composing the song so yeah it, it would be nice mm. if uh, I get the opportunity to collect with them, Mafits. Bangsit, hmm. siapa je yang tak kenal Bangsit Betul Dengan lagu dia memang terus hype yeah. Betul Pergi dia punya concert, best to know <laughs> Yeah Betul <laughs> Yeah. Although, although macam I have never been to the concert Tapi you know just by listening to the song pun dah You should Terus apa ni semangat You should try <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Uh, okay, since okay, kembali kepada DZ lah. Ini soalan untuk DZ. So, okay. sebab uh, DZ cakap tadi, DZ ada dal- involved dalam bidang kereta. And then, mm. if sila tak sila lah. Uh, I have research yang DZ pernah involved dalam Fauzia Nawi. Is it right? Fauzia Nawi, right? Uh, dia uh, pernah ambil kelas lah. Pernah ambil kelas, yes. Tiga kali lah ambil kelas. So, how's the class? How 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 benda tu how benda tu bagi uh, macam 
ada tak dia, dia punya input terhadap your acting or sebab kita belajar kan so bukan semua orang dapat chance untuk belajar so uh, tu cerita your experience experience um, so first of all yang class organizer tu is actually be open to public and like, they still buat lagi class so if you guys have any opportunity um, I highly suggest you guys try mm-hmm. uh, because dalam class tu, it will not only ajar you about acting, but it's all about confidence, it's all about voice projection, it's all about posture, so many things you guys can learn. Um, and for me, yang ni, I believe, this is what I hold strong, dia tu mahal daripada dulu lagi, uh, is that theater sebenarnya, uh, if you join theater, dia ajar you guys how to adapt with the real world. Because uh, ini ni bukan sahaja kepada kita, it's all to all uh, macam mana all form of arts lah macam modelling, macam performing semua tu sebenarnya orang macam um, apa benda ni, singing semua ni bukan yang boleh buat duit pun apa tapi kita punya skill tu boleh di apply in any uh, place pun macam as a host Um, I'm very grateful. I, I am Bikras dengan Fazanawi. Dia ada ajar about reaction, macam mana how to talk, how to deliver emotions and as an MC, as a host, um, I think it's one of the best quality to have when you uh, present something or you host something with emotion. Yeah. Uh, so, benda tu bukan saja boleh guna masa berlakon, bukan saja boleh guna masa perform, but boleh guna in your everyday life. So it was a really pleasant surprise and to be honest agak seram sikit lah <laughs> Yo Fazal we could hebat teruk ke siapa tak kenal lah Fazal Betul she's a legend she's a legend and she is super professional and bila you guys masuk kelas tu dia memang her goal is to make sure you guys betul-betul understand the basics of acting so mm. uh, and if you guys ada keluar masuk kan I guarantee you guys, you guys keluar daripada kelas tu, you will be a different person. I guarantee 100%. Wow. Serious, serious, serious. You will see, you will see life in a whole new perspective. Hmm, betul, uh, betul, 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 betul. Even though it's theater kan, tapi it's all about life. So uh, the impact betul. is not just uh, in the entertaining part. Yes, yes. To, to your whole yeah. life. Yes, yes, yes. Nice. Betul. Nice. So, to That's everyone, Eh, to everyone yang cakap performing arts tu You cannot guna dalam your everyday life Macam mm-hmm. You need to join dulu Then you know Betul right? tu yeah. Sokong Kena sangat Kena join dulu Baru you guys tahu Betul So dari, daripada pandangan kita jadi satu Kita join that class Kita ada banyak macam pandangan Betul Betul Betul, betul. Hmm. So, Okay this is like We're left only two questions uh, I want to know this one What is your worst and the best performance uh, you guys pernah buat tak kisahlah and bidang pun i want to know this i i the best itu tak apa but the the most embarrassing one ke the worst one ah uh, tu i want to know what happened but if you guys can make it short ni nak kore Yes. Ah <laughs> uh, uh, I think most of and of. Sebab tadi DZ dah cakap. Sebab tadi DZ dah cakap so kita start dengan aja pula. Okay okay. Uh, kita start dengan uh, best dulu lagi best, <laughs> best performance rasanya um, my first my second performance for Astena uh, actually uh, actually masa tu Fahmi pun ada kalau dia ingat um, we were performing masa tu malam oh. ulang tu uh, it, uh, it's for a newspaper oh. event something yes. like recycling newspaper yes. uh, I was performing with Fahmi and also one of our Astena mate juga, uh, Ikmal And my favourite was uh, when I was performing Best Part by Daniel Caesar oh, Sebab, uh, yeah, sebab uh, me and Ikmal, we harmonised that really good Even though macam we had we, we had lack of practice mm-hmm. apa semua And it turns out uh, one of my best performers juga lah masa tu oh. Without yeah. practicing, well, that's that good. is another level. <laughs> yes. We cannot. Nah, 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 n
pun asyik <laughs> from Astana pergi berkongsi juga lah <laughs> I think um, uh, I, won't, I won't say which event uh, But there's this one performance Masa tu I think the sound system teruk juga uh, So mid performance tu It was such a chaos juga lah macam We had Uh, we had macam little experience tau Macam having to improvise on stage And somehow it was pretty awkward On stage in front of the whole day one And Memang masa tu semua macam Atas stage boleh bayang semua macam Freeze macam uh, nak buat apa eh oh, With the like 200, 200 eyes watching you Watching you tau yang also, li, Lima orang atas stage yang macam Pas um, macam ni eh uh. And then lah uh, and then Kena drag balik the, the event tu macam drag for 50 minutes sebab <coughs> the sound system kena apa under maintenance semua So yeah, that's one of the worst performance That's there. something to remember Pasha, when you have 200 eyes watching you <laughs> Yeah, of course um, You know <laughs> How about uh, so, yeah, How about Pami? Your yeah. best and your worst uh, performance Ha ah, ni nak dengar yeah. agak ni <laughs> <laughs> so, Banyak yeah, pengalaman yeah, yeah. ni Banyak uh. pengalaman Okay lah, dia kena cerita benda yang paling orang nak tahu lah, the worst So the worst was Lupa lah ada satu event tu dengan Astina agak okay, <laughs> Banyak pula <laughs> event Astina eh, Saya ingat, saya ingat saya time tu raya tau Time tu uh, event tu raya Dekat Dewan Seri Sajana And then uh, ada satu lagu ni Saya salah lead, saya salah masuk lagu which is Time tu patutnya nyanyi lagu Dendang Perantau But then Uh, saya masuk lagu lain And then tem, Bila salah masuk tu kan Memang awkward lah Lepas awkward tu rasa macam Okay tak apa This is for the performance uh, Be professional And then Cakap dekat uh, Cakap dekat musician Main je main je Lagi aku masuk Lagu Lagu dia dalam perantau And then uh, sambung je Wow Wow And then that, that, that was the worst lah Sempat cover lagi lah uh. Sempat cover lah Itu yeah. yang penting Dah lah tentu dah sampai Macam satu lead best performance Tak itu the worst lah <laughs> Rasanya macam The worst aku eh Sebab aku salah lirik Dah lah salah lirik salah masuk lagi <laughs> So that was the worst Asal boleh improvise That was the worst and okay. the best Ya yeah. Asal boleh backup Asal boleh macam cover Go jalan Betul 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 And betul. then The best performance Was uh, <laughs> Saya lupa lah, tentu 2000 berapa eh uh, Open, eh open day lah uh, Ini time bazaar Dia tu saya perform as a drummer And that was my very first time playing drum As in a band Perform at a stage dengan Tak pernah ada pengalamannya stage, stage frighten pun semua uh, And then it went well So macam it was quite surprising but That was the best lah sebab Tak pernah main drum and tak pernah perform as Uh, in a band And then Bila tengok crowd semua enjoy Macam wow Gila babak best Semua yang sing along Semua rompat-rompat Semua Eh Betul. Itu memang good sebab lah So A fact, rasa a fact macam actually Me is one of the penonton Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ramai-ramai kat bawah tu I, I think that best. is the best part of being That's it uh, Performer or entertainer Is that when you have such Good yeah. crowd You will enjoy whatever you're doing mm. on stage Yeah, yeah. You will give you will give all out bagi all out lah semua untuk untuk crowd. Betul, betul. Hmm. Oh. But I like your worst story. Let's see. That's that is a very good thing. <laughs> worst story. <laughs> <laughs> worst story ni macam Oi, memberi kita semangat untuk improvise. Okay, let's move on to Gizi, your best and your worst performance. Okay. <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay, um let's start with the 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 okay, start with the best dulu lah. Tapi aje nak bagi tahu Uh, the disclaimer alert Dia memang akan related dengan Astena punya <laughs> Dia mesti related dengan Astena uh, Tapi Kita start semua ni ah, memang, okay, the, Semua start the, daripada Astena Semua reason, bermula daripada sini Astena je Betul uh, The reason why kita orang macam banyak Dengan Astena Because we love Astena so much And we uh, Spend a lot of time dengan Astena So that's why One of our best moments from dengan Astena One of the worst moments from Astena um, So hope, Hopefully the viewers kat rumah Tak salah anggap lah ya <laughs> 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 Sebab <laughs> daripada Astina lah uh, Keluarnya artis-artis Macam ada dengan family yeah. kan ah, Betul, 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 betul. <laughs> Promote sikit betul, betul, betul. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay so um, The best performance um, 
one I can think of like it's really the biggest one I like it is uh, performance I bought Master Club Bazaar still under Astina and Master Two. Um, I just realised though, dalam building plan Master Two ada orang rap lagi. Okay, mm-hmm. tak ada orang rap raps. The rap scene is very very new. So I'm like, okay, why not? Uh, this time I start rapping lah. And I rap and at that time pun I have lots of friends and dah ramai orang kenal and uh, I still remember masa tu I buat lagu uh, Macklemore, Camp Holders uh, dengan oh. Purple Lamborghini uh, Oh yeah uh, Rick Ross eh, uh, Rick Ross dengan mm. Skrillex as well kan um, So yeah, it's so fun because I get to do what I love and the best part is I think this thing all performers can relate lah. Apabila um, the audience, you guys punya viewers to join, sing with you guys, dance yeah. with you guys, just like it's it's not. Bila you guys dah reach to that point, it's not even performing anymore. It's just friends having fun. Yes. Betul lah. Ah, uh, it's like Betul. best Betul. Go, best view <coughs> and like everyone's like jumping like that and like rapping mm. together. It's it's so good lah. Ah, uh, but. Best moments may ada banyak sebenarnya but uh, can I add another one satu lagi lah? Sure, 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 sure. I, pas tu I dijemput untuk perform Unit 10 Fiesta 1 and uh, masa tu diorang panggil artis luar tau. So one of the famous artists masa tu is Defam. So I literally shared the stage dengan Defam. Uh, cuba not at the same time lah. Uh, uh, tapi kita orang duduk dalam the same room so kita orang ada laburan-laburan sikit and masa tu ada satu uh, this is a big boxer juga, I don't remember his name which also really cool um, so that's like for me one of the first uh, memorable rap performance lah I get to share with them and I ada ambil gambar dengan diorang lagi so it's pretty cool uh, DFAM, they're so cool like uh, I, I, yeah, I'm, it's just so cool <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it's really you know, so cool yeah, yeah, it was so excited <laughs> uh, you know when it's so good, you don't know the words to say it out uh, mm. uh, Fanboy moment Fanboy moment, betul? Betul! Betul Okay, uh, so uh, the worst The worst part Maybe One of the worst moments uh, Not one of the worst lah uh, But definitely one of the challenging uh, challenge, The most challenging uh, performance is um, I have tons I have tons of uh, masalah Every time performance, uh, but this one must start acting um, on with uh, my awesome Ellie, Ellie Hazlin. Uh, we were performing lagu uh, Piramli sebenarnya, lagu Piramli yang lagu itu. So um, kita orang nyanyi and then sampai this one part, I was supposed to sing. Out of nowhere, I terlupa. Literally. <laughs> My partner tu Ellie, dia pandang saya, dia macam What are you doing? I was like Oh my god Dah lah, dah lah Masa tu tengah competition tau Oh my god What? Oh my god Oh my god Yes, on stage From Ellie So yeah, to, to Ellie, I'm really sorry about that But uh, it was a nice performance kan <laughs> Yeah uh, But um, to be honest, sebenarnya worst um, some this setbacks yang kita ada masa performing sebenarnya perlu sebenarnya as a performer because it, mm-hmm. dia, dia build up you punya um, apa professionalism. So yeah. um, to all inspire, inspiring, uh, aspiring, uh, to all up and coming um, <laughs> artists, performer, model, singer, host, uh, don't be afraid to make mistakes because. Um, one of the best lessons that you can learn is from your own mistake. So yeah, I think that's all. So we are not going to see this. Thank you, thank you. We are enjoying listening to you. Yeah, thank you, thank you so much. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, okay, sebab kita pun, masa kita pun tak cukup mm. So kita akan last dengan question kita lah Okay, okay. give <coughs> advice kepada sesiapa yang nak join entertainer Siapa yang nak jadi entertainer, siapa nak jadi pengacara Korang punya advice kepada orang. Uh, start with Rami Start dengan uh, Rami Oh, as an entertainer eh <laughs> So, dia sebenarnya once datang minat tu, buat je Minat like, like macam nak belajar main gitar Okay so ambil gitar 
Tak kisahlah pinjam membunyi ke Rasa macam ada duit lebih nak beli Okay beli je And main 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 je macam Contoh nak macam nak main lagu favorite Okay just main Keep keep going Keep just keep keep doing it Just express yourself uh, Through the instrument Sebab Once it Itu je satu Kira macam uh, Starting point untuk musician Untuk macam discover lebih Dengan Buat je The passion And Kalau cakap shot sendiri Tak kisah shot sendiri pun Asalkan sebab uh, Shot sendiri tu sebenarnya Cara kita untuk express Dia sendiri tau So kita buat Benda yang kita minat tu Untuk untuk dia sendiri Bukan untuk orang So yeah that's it Just macam Keep keep doing it Tak tak payah fikir orang buat uh, Orang cakap apa Just buat Itu je So that's it Shot simple and Jadi as. <laughs> okay, uh, how about okay, Lizzie, your advice to the people? Okay, uh, my advice banyak sekarang. <laughs> okay, um, short, short, sweet lah, short, 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 sweet then. Okay, um, for to all again upcoming um, former kids, um, if you want to do something that you love, by all means, just do it. Macam kami cakap, start je, walaupun rasa rasa pelik pakai gitar kan, at least pegang and then let your soul teach you uh, mm-hmm. macam tu, let your passion teach you, you don't have to force it um, and uh, yang ni, I always tell my friends semua um, jangan uh, be demotivated, jangan rasa sedih apabila contohnya you guys minat sangat uh, nak perform kan you guys nak menyanyi, then you guys masuk competition, you guys kalah kan uh, mm-hmm. jangan get demotivated, jangan cakap macam oh, aku dah kalah, so mungkin Uh, ini bukan aku punya passion lah kot uh, yeah. uh, uh, You actually just have to keep on going Because rezeki tu akan datang bila-bila saja And dari angle yang you guys takkan pernah expect tu uh, So yeah. macam And uh, being a performer Yang ni uh, kena tahu juga lah Performer ni is not only about singing Talking to people, modeling Even if you are an engineer You love what you're doing If you work well and people see that you work well, you are actually performing to people juga sebenarnya betul tak? Uh, so, performing sebenarnya it's not just about entertainment performing is your life uh, your life is yeah. your show, your stage so, why not make the best out of it? Uh, well, well said yeah. well said you yeah. <laughs> okay. oh, ya, boleh saya tambah satu? Ah, boleh, boleh. Ah, tambah, tambah. boleh 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 so, sebenarnya kan Art ni subjektif Dia hmm. tak ada betul dan tak ada salah betul. So rasa, kalau rasa macam Bila kita nak start something ni Rasa macam eh betul ke apa aku buat ni betul ke Takut orang yang lagi berilmu Tengok kita buat ni salah semua Tak tak ada tak ada langsung Semuanya subjektif Tak ada betul tak ada salah Just keep doing it Buat sebab kita suka Buat sebab macam that's the way uh, Kita boleh express ourselves Just keep 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 doing it Betul <coughs> betul Wow From yeah. Ada, your advice. Yeah. Ada. Okay. Since ramai dah kau. Memang ramai kau. Okay. Uh, I think macam one thing that I can add to these points. Uh, um, macam kami cakap, just keep on doing. Sebab uh, it, maybe it will take two or three years yes. out to see the fruition of your passion. To just don't get macam discouraged lah awal awal. Memang no one no one will get success in one day macam tu maybe oh. just a couple few je sikit but yang paling penting macam uh, ikut apa peribahasa orang putih lah yeah. a room was not built in a day yeah, yeah. betul yeah. Wow. <laughs> okay and also um, you know art can is expressing yourself while you are expressing yourself to kind while you you giving out content creating stuff And I think uh, you need to take into account yang macam uh, expressing yourself is interacting with people, with the public kan. Okay? So yang mm-hmm. paling penting you have to be respectful juga lah. True, true. Sebab uh, yes, sometimes art ni macam Fahmi cakap it's subjective kan. People don't know the boundaries kan kan lah. Sebab uh, macam maybe you think this is right, this is wrong. Sebab oh there's no wrong in art. Mm. But yang paling penting you have to be respectful in, in macam expressing yourself. True. So there are, uh, there are a lot of people macam might be offended by what you're expressing Maybe you're doing something that's uh, quite morally wrong juga ke kan 
So at the same time, try to educate yourself juga while while expressing your art. Uh, basically, betul, betul, you gotta betul. respect the art lah yes. in general. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Betul. So we heard their advices and the experience that they went through. So to those young, not very entertaining sure. life, which is actually really fun, although it's quite mm-hmm. challenging but fun. Uh, you can follow yep. through the advices and just start. Like Pami said, boleh just just mula yep. saja dulu and then like see where it goes, where it takes you. Kalau nak lagi banyak Betul. advice, DM lah kita orang Eh boleh <laughs> Ada bawah lah, ada bawah Ada bawah ni kan Betul Kita letak uh, Instagram Betul, lah. Betul. Dia punya account Instagram yeah. semua kat bawah okay. uh, So basically, it's okay to take yeah. the first step lah Yes Kan Nisha Kalau kalau kita so. tak try, then we will never know what will happen So just start and then see where yeah. it takes you Alright, so yes. we are running out of time But this is the last session We are going to play a small game, a little game which is the spinning wheel. Uh, as you can see, yes. I have streamed the live. Boleh tengok dalam okay. dalam live tu. So spinning wheel. Yeah. So like wow. it, you have to, wheel. to do either one of these acts. Uh, they are the line typical kena rijer, lawak hamba, berlakon, menyanyi, pick up line dan DJ or radio, uh, DJ radio or hosting. So. <laughs> um, wow. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go one by one. Uh, so right now. Let's just go in easy first, okay? Kejap, I, I kena tekan watch yeah, stream dulu. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Oh, yeah, you kena tekan watch ah, stream. Tak <laughs> maaf lah. Dulu, biasanya ada orang ada buat bot, semua kena pusing. Kena tekan busy ke? Sekarang online kan? Ah, Betul, dia macam okay. senang alim. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, ah. so macam, uh, so right now I'm going to spin this wheel for busy. Uh, yeah. Mana-mana Please lah, dapat lawak hamba. <laughs> I'm so good at lawak hamba. Mana-mana <laughs> 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 Kurang kena buat, okay? Okay, let's see. Okay. Okay? Oh, okay, let's go. Oh my god. Oh, this is so easy. Oh, oh, Senang sangat. Tak ada, tak ada. Kenan, kenan. I don't ask her, ask her. Oh, tak ada. This is so easy for him. Okay, okay. Okay, boleh, boleh, boleh. boleh. Okay, let's go. It's so easy. Uh, beyond our apa, comfort zone, kan? Yeah. Uh, Bersama, okay. Betul, okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, tapi kau kena radio host gak? Sorry lah guys Okay <laughs> Oh my god Lagi pikir kena rejek Lama hamba Lagi sikit je lama hamba Okay, lagi <laughs> give, give us the best that you got Lagi typical kena rejek Kena rejek eh? Mm. I mean orang orang bagi lain kat ayah. Yes, tak anything that you hear very typical so of the Anything. Mm-hmm. Um one thing yang I biasa dapat bukan lain lah. I dapat blue tick lah. Itu paling rajin lah. <laughs> ah, the best. Dua lain, dua lain. 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 Dua lain, dua dia tak wujud sama ni Eh tu ada Tapi ada yang lagi lain lah Biasa orang bagi lah eh, Sama yang perform semua Dia cakap uh, Okay uh, Apa-apa I'll contact you lah Ha ah, itu Ya oh. yeah, yeah, biasa dia Lepas kena buat tunggu je lah Member pun tunggu lah lah Sebulan dua Tak dapat apa-apa <laughs> Bila tanya dapat blue tick Sedih Betul Betul Tapi tak apa Masih ada ramai lagi So janganlah get discouraged Ya Biasalah tu, kena reject tu biasa guys Rejection is part of life <laughs> Betul Okay, okay. So, okay. sama ada okay. Pami Ada okay. Aida Which one of you want to go first? Ah, Aida Amah dia angkat tangan Ya, dia angkat Dia angkat dah, dia angkat Let's see Itu hint Aduh Ini semua senang juga Ini senang juga Ya, ni aduh. Tukar, tukar, tukar. Ini kira komedi zone dia. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna. Ini nak benda something. I'm something gonna something different. Do this. Okay. Adjust, so, adjust, adjust. Remove dah, dah menyanyi. Remove dah menyanyi. Tak apa. Okay. Dia orang tak pernah berlaku. Oh, yeah. Tukun. Pick up line. Pick up line. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, to all the viewers. Tempai nak bagi heart air eh, dekat Adam. <laughs> <laughs> 
Nice. Pick up line juga kan. Pick up line apa-apa pun. Ah, saya akan pick up line. Pick up line apa-apa je. Kita tengok, kita tengok. How ada buat pick up line. Alamak, sorry lah. Tak tahu lah nak cakap apa. Macam mana ada Bukan sebelum ni Alah syakkan tak boleh try Alah Takkan lah Oh ok 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 Alamak ada 2-3 kali Amoi Mungkin ada punya pick alam macam ni kot Dah tu kan Dah tu Ok Adam Memang tak je Contoh lah situasi ni kan macam The girl Buat buat lawak tu. So dia 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 buat lawak kan. Lepas tu sekarang ni dah mesra lah, dah mesra. Kalau kan lepas tu cakap lah macam hey, kelakar lawak ni. Boleh tak nak beli lawak you? Oh. Ah. Tadi lagi. Tak apa tak apa. 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 Masa ni uh, contoh lah pick up line Namun pick up line kan maknanya belum jumpa lah Okay okay Eh boleh tak saya beli lawak ni? Masa Kau pun cakap lah nak, nak beli Boleh je uh, Nak nak beli nak bayar macam mana? Oh boleh tak kita COD? Boleh boleh So nak kita jumpa lah Dating lah maknanya Cash on date oh. 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 I did not see that comic I did not see that comic Nice 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 I thought we were nice Boleh contoh Nak, nak, nak jumpa orang baru ke boleh guna ayat tu lah Tapi kalau orang tiba-tiba cakap Bang, saya nak COD Macam mana tu? Abang Ini macam Oh my god, my god Orang lain tu tak COD tu Lain macam dah Adam Ya, yeah, tu macam mana tu? Macam mana? Ah, tu nak jadi influencer Tak apa, jangan tentu Itu barrier ya, satu sensitivity Jangan tentu Ya yeah. No, no, no Okay, last kali, Fahmi Fahmi, Fahmi tak pernah try semua ni Tapi let's Let's just ah, ayo, ayo. Relate that ah. Ikut Zohar Mina Saya dapat apa eh? Ah, pick up line lagi Pick up line Pick up line, ha, ha. ha Boleh, boleh, boleh hmm. Pick up line eh <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, so Pekat line ni Saya pernah bagi lah Tem Cuba mengorat Saya punya girlfriend Aboy, so siapa yang Friends tengok ni Stand by lah, stand by lah <laughs> Bobot tak tahu Stand by, stand by, stand by, stand by, stand by. <laughs> So <laughs> the, the, Pekat line ni berbunyi Are you a vocabulary? Because I could find the meaning of soul meat in you Oh, yes. Oh, ya, Desi. Padu sangat ni, kan? Padu. Saya nak tengok buat apa dia. Okey, Apa beza KLCC dengan awak? Hello. Jumpa, jumpa eh Hello Jumpa okay. KLCC Malaysia punya Awak saya punya <laughs> Mantap Lepas 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 Boleh boleh Lepas 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 Ah, dia ya, ya, boleh ya. pergi jauh tapi lagi jauh daripada awak tu lah. Ah. <laughs> okay, okay. Alright. So, uh, to summarize everything that has been going on of this laughter. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, kita dengar ada advice, experience dorang uh, from hosting, berlakon, menyanyi, modelling, yang siap nak, nak apa, collaborate Betul. dengan this brand and that that company uh, mm-hmm. so we can see that this uh, being an entertainer dia memang bukannya kita entertain orang kita pun rasa sendiri keseronokan tu betul betul, betul. dia macam apa yang penting dalam kehidupan kita kita kena fikirkan diri kita dulu 
dulu Kita kena rasa uh, Minat diri kita dulu Baru kita ekspresi yeah. orang yeah. lain And also yeah, True okay. Okay. Uh, uh, Macam uh, a reminder okay, Apa yang Nuan cakap macam When you Minat that something You just start You take the first step Kalau tak We never know <laughs> I guess Betul. we never know yeah. okay. Belum try belum tahu Betul Belum try belum tahu Betul <laughs> <laughs> eh, I like that word. Yeah. Belum try, belum tahu. Betul, betul. Alright. Um, so, okay lah. Masa pun tak mengizinkan kita. So, takat ini sahaja kita punya talk show. So, lepas ni sambung kena mamak eh. So, tag. <laughs> betul. <laughs> Boleh. Berbuka, berbuka ni mamak. 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 Hmm. Betul. 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 Uh, saya start, saya start dulu lah Okay, okay ah. um, Thank you to um, Akila, Nisha and also Astina for inviting all of us um, yeah, We enjoy teruk lah <laughs> Enjoy teruk lah this uh, talk Kalau boleh, Pak Di buat lagi lah Insya Allah Insya Allah Okay, uh, Akhidah, thank you so much um, I hope you guys are inspired by watching this um, video And teruskan um, create a legacy for yourself Thank you so much. Thank you. Nice. Uh, Adam, any last words? Thank you. Uh, saya berpihak kepada Nisha. Betul, betul. Okay, Mami, any last words before we end? So, first of all, terima kasih lah sebab membuat saya untuk this talk show and satu lagi lah, lagi sekali saya cakap, just Uh, put your priority to yourself Just uh, express yourself Buat something yang korang suka Sebab in the end, tak ada orang yang boleh happy dengan kita Menaikan diri sendiri So, benda tu je yang tolong kita hidup So, yeah, just keep doing it Yes, betul Alright, that is all from me Dan Anisha, selamat berpuasa dan selamat berbuka petang Jangan lupa sekarang <laughs> Buka maghrib eh, maghrib Dan saya, Kila <laughs> Mama maghrib Betul, Mami Bye guys Okay, bye guys That's all for you, bye